So hello uh, YouTube people. I thought it would be fun to do a video on my blight family because some people in the community uh, got recently got into blights and I never really uh, showed mine uh, on, on YouTube. So yes, I thought it would be fun to show uh, mine. Uh, I don't have a whole lot but a a, a good collection of them. <laughs> so let's start with the girl on the left. She is a uh, Ashton Drake girl. She is not a Takara release, but um, a reproduction of the Kenners. So she is uh, well. She she looks very Kennerish, but she's not the same. But she is my uh, Noella. And she's very cute and she's a little bit of a... She has a bit of an attitude. <laughs> That's what I like about her. And this is my Nanon. She is a EVL Cinnamon Girl. So she's an official Takara release. But I have customized her. As you can see. Oh, if it's focusing. And... Um, Yes, she is one of my most recent blight customs. And this is one that is staying around. And this is Ronja, my very first Kenner. I was so excited to get her. I got her uh, two years ago or almost. I think I got her in May. So yeah, I really like her. She's very beautiful. So she's 43 years old. But it doesn't really show. Well, it does. She has some marks, but I mean she's still very beautiful. So yes, I really love her. And this is my second Kenner girl who's very minty. She's very beautiful. She's she's, she's well, she's almost like new. <laughs> and uh, she has uh, very soft hair, but that needed a lot of treatment. But, um, oh, and I will also, uh, for the people who don't own a canner, I will let you hear the pip. Because they sound very different than uh, Takara blights or fakes. Uh, I normally roll with the hand so she can look a bit up. But yes, this is Allison. This is a girl I got recently. She is a, a EBL fruit punch, but I put her on the Licka body. Uh, she has had a haircut, not by me, but by a previous owner. I did bowl her, so she, uh, she looks a bit more... Uh, it's just made more of a wide-eyed look, but she's super cute. So yeah, that's her. I don't have a name for her yet. Oh, and this is this is my very first blight. She is a uh, stock. Uh, well, when I bought her, she was a stock Nikki Lad. And since then she has been customized, but she was not my first custom. I, I practiced on Basak's first, but she was my very first Blight doll. So, uh, yeah, her name is Nikki, and I think she's quite cute. And I have thought about selling her, but I couldn't in the end, so <laughs> she will be staying. And this is a stock T for two EBL girls. I, I really like the EBL mold and she has extremely long hair well she is sort of a mini me because my hair is also well extremely <laughs> long so and this, uh, this girl is called Minu or was it Manu I'm not sure anymore but I think it's Manu Minu no. <laughs> anyway uh, and this is uh, EBL, um, what's her name again? Love Mission. She's really beautiful. She has raven black hair, so it's 
well, then it's it's just very, very dark brown. She's really beautiful, she's still on her normal body. Um, yeah, well, I don't play a lot with her, she's just sitting pretty. <laughs> and this girl is a mystery girl. She, um, I bought her last year with two other girls, but I bought them with friends. I actually put a box opening of them on the on my channel. They probably are prototypes of the very first Takara releases. So I'm thinking this girl is a prototype. Oh, I'll show you without her glasses. She is probably a prototype of Biel Mondi, but I can't be sure. I asked Junko Wong about her, but she never replied. So we will never know, probably. But yeah, her iMac is stuck, but. Uh, I still can roll her by hand, so she's very good. She looks a lot like a BL girl, but she looks also very cannerish. So yeah, this is uh, Madeliefje, which is uh, Daisy in Dutch. Uh, well, let's go to this girl first. She is a Basak. She was my very first custom, but I have, uh, in the meantime, she has been uh, through some more custom. So. It, this is not my first attempt. <laughs> her name is Vera. Oh well, she's quite cute, but I'm planning on redoing her, her makeup. And then my most dear girl is also a Basak. This was my second custom. And since then she's never changed. Her name is Fientje. And I adore her so much. I think she's just uh, so, so cute. I really like her and she will never, never, never ever leave. <laughs> so, yeah, that's her little toddler. And then I also have a few girls that are in the making. Which is a friendly freckles girl. And I have, her carving is almost done. And then I will have to paint her and put her on Lika and make also some eye chips and this girl which her, her bangs are a little bit weird but she is a simply guava girl which I'm also almost done with carving but I'm sanding her sanding is also the, was always the hardest work I uh, re root no I didn't re root it I rooted some extra hair in her hair because normally simply guavas are just pink but I rooted in some red orange color so she looks very fiery so yeah th those are my blight dolls i hope you enjoyed this video and uh, yeah bye bye